Hello Cancer, welcome to another love reading. This is going to be a how they feel about you love reading where we'll look at your person, how they're thinking or feeling about you. Um, what are their next actions going to be towards you and what's going on in the connection. So we're going to get right into it. This as always is a general reading, so it will not resonate with every Cancer watching. So take what resonates, leave the rest. If it doesn't resonate at all, that's okay. Check out my playlist for Cancer videos. I have a ton. Let's see, what messages do you have for Cancer regarding love? I'm using a brand new deck today that I'm loving. I'll have it linked down below um, where I list all of the decks that I use in the description box. All right, Spirit, for Cancer, what do they need to know regarding love? what's going on in your love life cancer okay we got the two of wands reverse with the three of swords disappointment pain with the three of swords maybe a bad conversation um i feel like someone here was unfaithful but i don't want to jump the gun we'll see what else i get I feel like someone was playing both sides. Let's see. What's going on for Cancer, Spirit, and Love? What's going on in this connection? Three of Wands. Nope. What is this? Sorry. Page of Wands Reverse. I'm still learning this deck. <laughs> Page of Wands Reverse. Ten of Swords. Yikes. What the hell's going on, Cancer? Some of you are like, you tell me. <laughs> Ten of Swords and the Page of Wands reverse. So again, I feel like there's been some sort of heartbreaking, painful situation. If you're dealing with someone that you're just over the moon with and super happy and relaxed, this is probably not your reading. <laughs> this is for those of you where there's probably been some sort of betrayal here. There's been a cycle that has come to a close. Some, something that's been devastating. And I feel it was someone, it's like, it's like you found something out through like conversation or something like that. Two of cups, nine of cups reversed and the hermit reversed. Wow. So this person, I feel for a lot of you was a soulmate or is a soulmate. Um, you felt like this was a very strong connection, very beautiful connection, probably had a lot of hopes set on this person but it it didn't happen that way for you with the hermit reverse virgo energy um i feel like someone got ghosted or someone ran away didn't want to face the situation maybe they didn't want to face what happened or didn't want to confront what they had done Let's clarify some of these. Let me clarify for Cancer, please. Let me clarify these energies, Spirit. For Cancer. Tell me about this Two of Wands reverse. Why is the Two of Wands reverse? The moon, yeah. There was something here that you didn't know about. Pisces energy. A secret, something that possibly fell off. The lover's reverse. Gemini energy. There was a separation. Maybe you weren't clear why things ended. Or maybe you were confused at, as to what happened. Um, can I get one more for this two of wands reverse? But it was almost like um, there was something hidden here. An illusion of some sort. Maybe this person wasn't who you thought they were. Yeah, and I feel like with the Seven of Wands, it's like you've been trying to protect yourself, guard yourself, fight back. Maybe there's been a lot of conflict with this person, arguments, fights.
Tell me about the Page of Wands reverse. Some of you didn't want to hear or, or didn't want to face the truth. That's a small number of you, but I feel like it's almost like you didn't want to believe it. Tell me about the Page of Wands reverse. Yeah, this was a conversation or something you saw on social media or online. Tell me more about this Page of Wands reverse. I feel like um, whatever, whenever you found this out or whatever, whenever this happened, it's like you couldn't sleep. Things were off, temperance reverse, Sagittarius energy. Two of swords at the bottom. Again, I feel like a lot of you were blinded to what was going on or didn't want to face what happened or didn't want to believe it. I feel like some of you probably had nightmares or it just, you couldn't sleep, you couldn't eat, you were probably really stressed, very unbalanced. Um, maybe you try to make things work. I don't think, I don't think it did though with the 10 of swords. Tell me about the nine of cups reverse. For cancer spirit why is the nine of cups reverse the high priestess tell me about the nine of cups reverse the high priestess and the moon there's something here i feel like you didn't know yeah the tower man i just feel so like i just felt like this like i felt like my heart sank I think whatever this was, was very, like I said, devastating. This was devastating. And I really don't think you saw it coming. Like, I think this was a shock to you. Um, I think this was a huge secret or huge revelation. If this is resonating for you, leave me a comment if you're comfortable. Do not have to go into details. Just telling me it resonates or that you did have a tower moment is fine, but I feel like this is a very specific reading. I don't think it'll be for all of you, but I feel like with the sun reverse here and the high priestess, you did not see this coming. This was a shock to you. Maybe you were the one that ran away or this was very sudden. Tell me about, oh, hold on, just wait a minute. Tell me about the, uh, the hermit reverse. Tell me about the hermit reverse. It could also be that even though things have ended here between you, some of you are still talking to this person or watching this person or vice versa. Someone possibly played you here with the Knight of Wands reverse. Someone wasn't, this is somebody that is not able to face the consequences of their actions, doesn't think before they act. Tell me about the Hermit reverse. This person could have cheated on you or been unfaithful, stepped out of a connection, which is kind of the same thing. <laughs> the hangman reverse. This is someone who, um, they don't want to give anything up. They don't want to sacrifice. Very selfish energy. So let's see, how is this person thinking or feeling about you? How do they feel about you? I'm using my... Secret Moon Oracle deck. This is my first physical deck and it's out now. It's linked down below. If you'd like to check it out, check the pictures and all that good stuff. I love this deck. <laughs> Tell me more, Spirit. How is this person thinking or feeling about cancer? How are they thinking or feeling about cancer, please? How are they thinking or feeling? about cancer at this time. That's way too many. How are they thinking or feeling about cancer, please? You make me happy. 
I see you in my dreams. And when I saw that card, I did not think this person, um, I feel like their conscience isn't letting them sleep. I'm afraid to tell you how I feel. And I want to see you at the bottom. I feel like you're not seeing this person right now. And I'm also like, I see you in my dreams. It's almost like, I don't know. It's with you make me happy. And I see you in my dreams. I'm not picking that up as a positive energy. I know that sounds crazy because you make me happy is very positive, but it's almost like, um, like I see you in my dreams because I screwed something up so so badly. That's what I'm picking up. So we'll see. Let's get some more information here about how they're thinking or feeling about you. Tell me more, Spirit. How are they thinking or feeling about Cancer? How are they thinking or feeling about Cancer? How are they thinking or feeling? Move this down here. How are they thinking or feeling about cancer? The sun reverse. How are they thinking or feeling about cancer? The lovers, Gemini energy. How are they thinking or feeling about cancer? The King of Swords. Let me clarify before I say what I instantly thought about. Because I'm hoping I'm wrong. For Cancer Spirit. Help me clarify, please. Help me clarify these energies. Tell me about the sun reverse. Magician reverse. Ace of wands and the full reverse. Okay. Ace of wands, the full reverse. This is a message to me as a reader that this person, um, they want a new beginning despite doing the work or despite planning or thinking of the outcome. Again, this is someone that jumps into something new without thinking. The full reverse, reckless, risky energy. Someone that doesn't look where they're stepping. If they're not careful, they can walk right off a cliff. I feel like this is someone who, with the magician reverse, they're gonna try to make this happen. They're gonna try to make something happen here with you, with the lovers and the king of swords, maybe communicate with you. But with the sun reverse, this is, to me, is a um, something hidden. It's almost like this person is not really being completely honest. I'm afraid to tell you how I feel. So I don't, you know, I right away I don't trust this energy, especially with the magician reverse. And they're not going to be successful. I have the Six of Wands reversed at the bottom. Because if you don't plan things well, if you don't think about how you affect others or the consequences of your actions, you tend to make mistakes. Tell me about the lovers. Page of Swords reversed. See what I'm saying? There's something here that's unclear or not communicated well or hidden, like something that's not completely honest. It's not the whole story. Eight of Pentacles reverse. This person could be telling you that things are going to be different, that they're going to work on things now with you. I wouldn't, I wouldn't believe them right away. And I feel like it's almost like I feel like in their mind with the King of Swords, they want to be this upstanding, confident, 
honest person, but for some reason, I just don't believe it. Tell me about the King of Swords. This could also be you, the energy that you bring to this connection at this time. Queen of Pentacles. It's almost like this person wants to match you, Cancer. I'm picturing you as this Queen of Pentacles. <laughs> the messages that I hear. <laughs> I just heard someone saying, she doesn't need him. <laughs> it doesn't have to be a female. This one, it, basically what I'm getting is, you're good all by yourself. You don't need this other person. Tell me about the king of swords. But that message, she doesn't need him. It was like yelled, like someone yelled it. Tell me about the king of swords. Ten of cups. Ooh, no. Some of you might have children with this person. Some of you could be married to this person. Tell me more about this King of Swords. This is not good energy that I'm feeling, Cancer. Hermit reversed again. I feel like if this person comes to talk to you, they're not going to want to talk about what happened or their part in it. It's almost like they want to gloss over it. Is this the emperor? Yes, this is the emperor. Emperor at the bottom of the deck. With strength. Leo energy, Aries energy here. This person really wants to rebalance the situation, bring things back into control. But with the hermit reversed, they're not listening to advice, they're not they're not thinking clearly. Ugh, I don't like this energy. I don't like this energy cancer tell me if this is resonating are you married to this person or have children to this person because i feel like they're going to use that against you or not against you but as a as a reason to stay together you might not have children with this person maybe they have children somewhere else or you are have children or maybe there's a promise of having a family here that someone's going to try to like use in conversation. So what are their next actions going to be towards you? So let's see, what are their next actions going to be towards cancer? Six of swords, five of wands, their next action is going to be what are their next actions going to be towards cancer I feel like their next actions are going to cause yeah king of wands reverse this person could have a temper or perhaps they're just someone that doesn't think about other people I feel like their actions are going to cause some sort of drama or conflict. Maybe this is already taking place. They could be traveling to see you with the Six of Swords. Tell me about the Six of Swords. Why is the Six of Swords here? Yeah, they want to return to you, Cancer. If they've left the home or something like that that's what they want to do here tell me about the five of wands of course this is completely up to you i'm not saying that you have to take them back but i feel like they're going to be using this connection that you have um perhaps they want to make you an offer or tell you that you are the one for them 
Tell me about this King of Wands reverse. Yeah. They have renewed interest. They have renewed interest, but once again, the Hermit reverse. I feel like they're also trying to avoid the main problem. This person is not able to face the situation or really be do the right thing. I feel like when this person comes to you to make you this offer, some of you are going to really be like, but is that a good idea? Is it going to work? Should I trust them this time? Would this be a good investment? I think it's going to be completely up to you, Cancer. Thank you so much for uh, likes, shares, comments, subscribes, all that good stuff, Cancer. Um, if you're new here, welcome. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much for sticking around. And I'll see you all in another video. Take care.